हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल दीपानीता क्रिएटिविटी इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू सेव क्रिसम प्लांट्स फॉर नेक्स्ट ईयर These are my chrysanthemum plants. Flowers are now brown and all parts of the plant looks dry. I will save this plant for the next year. First, I am cutting all the branches. Six inches above the soil level. Remove the supporting stick. Remove all dry leaves and branches which laid on the soil. If we not clean this fungal growth will occur and plant will be dead This is new growth From this new growth we get flowers from the next year This is one of my giant chrysanthemum plant. I do the same process for this plant. We save chrysanthemum plants because we could not lose favorite plants. and we gardener wants to grow same flowering plants for the next year we also prepare many plants by cutting this is numbering tag i have different colored chrysanthemum plants so i numbered them for identification this is my seven number tag Chrysanthemum plants are available on September to October nursery but then we cannot make them bushy properly because of the shortage of time December is the flowering time of the chrysanthemum This is my another colored chrysanthemum plant I have done the same process if we save them cuttings are prepared on March and the plants are ready on April to May then time to time pinching is done and plants get bushy from more branches we get more flowers after removing branches fungicide spray is necessary to avoid fungal infection after 7 days we should spray 
any pesticide for avoiding any pest attack. We should keep this pot in semi shaded area in our garden. This protects plants from the scorching sun of summer days. Every day we should water them. We should use any type of fertilizer once in a month. I use mustard cake liquid fertilizer or kitchen waste liquid fertilizer.